It's Nana with livingcooper.com. Today I have a Coops simple how-to for you. I'm going to show you how to make seven of our favorite keto approved drinks. Some are hot, some are cold. You'll see we add ketones to some of them because there's just days we can't stay on track. Life happens, we don't always stay 100% keto. Anyway, let's get started. I got a lot to show you. I think I got a coffee problem. Yeah, hot or cold coffee? Which is your favorite? Uh, like them all, I guess. Depends on the time of day, time of year. Yeah, I'm aiming at uh, that one over there. This is nice and cool, keto slushy, no caffeine. I don't need any more caffeine today. It's 7.30. 7.30 at night. I've been working on this video, and that's caffeine. Caramel that's macchiato. The caramel macchiato ketone coffee from my lunchbox. I'm a little Stanley cooler. Cooler, tumbler, keeps it nice and cold. Really good. And then maybe her mocha frappe, but this is the keto version. She's got another video of the non keto version. This is a keto version, and it's also caffeinated. It is caffeinated. So I don't need any more of this, all right? <laughs> but it's good. And only seven carbs, you said? Seven carbs? Only because of the beeswax and the protein. You could do that both, and it would be zero. Well, the only problem is there's no beeswax in this. I think Nana's had her own caffeine or something. Be pollen. My bad. Big difference. Big difference. The protein that you put in it was five, so that's seven. One or one more. But anyways, there's like seven or eight cards, maybe. But, but it's a big thing, and this is be like a dessert drink or something like that. So. Well, you had it for dinner sometimes. Yeah, exactly, because it's got the protein and stuff in it. You drink this whole thing, you don't feel like eating anymore. So How but about, it's, it's good. Does this fill you up the same or not really? It's just a liquid. So oh, and then there's my, my bulletproof coffee. Uh, has, I guess, two based on the bee pollen. And that's all I got in there, just the bee pollen extra, other than the other bulletproof stuff, which doesn't really have anything. And then there's the buy, and this is about half a container. Yeah, it's about half, in. and it's one. So it says it's got six total carbs, but five of those are the erythritol, and which is a sugar alcohol, so it doesn't go against your sugar. So there was only one. So there's one carb in this thing, and this is really good because it's not all caffeinated and stuff. This would be a good slushy drink. Free tasting. My favorite is the Puna Coconut with the Tiger's Blood. But you might like something else. They come in all kinds of flavors. With all kinds of flavors. You just have to mix and match. So. Just like having a snow cone in the summer. Yep, just yeah. like it. Make it whatever. And then I've got my unsweet tea with my lemon ketones. This will get me over my 12 carbs of sugar in my Bulletproof. Is that right? It's 12. I'm gonna have to learn to not do that. Yeah, don't put sugar in bulletproof. Man, it's still. Mm. 
working on? Working on. She needs a downsize of two teaspoons, I guess. There's three teaspoons and a tablespoon. She's got a tablespoon. I guess the next step is to go to two teaspoons. I just don't like coffee. But the struggle is real. Nice shot. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for sticking around and watching us make our seven favorite keto drinks. It takes probably 60 seconds or so to whip up something like the bai, because it's just bai and powder and ice. The bulletproof takes a little bit longer. There's quite a few ingredients. To make the frappe, it takes even longer because you've got to make the bulletproof, freeze the ice cubes, and then blend it all, add the ingredients and blend it. But you know, it's worth it. And I, I don't drink Starbucks. I would imagine that's a five or seven dollar drink at Starbucks. Oh yeah. It's nowhere near that. And then with the mocha, uh, the Pops cold brew caramel macchiato, it's cold brew coffee and some ketones, shake it, you're good to go. So it's all pretty quick and simple, very easy, accessible treat. And if you're trying to stay keto, keto friendly, you almost have to have ketones. We try. I sure hope this helps you guys out. I hope you've learned a few drinks that we've kind of concocted on our own and things that we've tailored to our taste and our likes. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Thumbs down if you didn't. Constructive criticism, comments, ideas, recipes that you've tried or not tried, something that I can use instead of plain white sugar in my coffee to get rid of the coffee flavor. That would be helpful for Nana. You can find our recipes on the blog at livingcooper.com. We'll get them pinned to Pinterest and Instagram and Twitter. We're at livingcooper at all of those. You'll find some links in the description to our, some of our favorite things that we purchase. Hopefully this content was usable by you. And if you know anybody else that could use it, please share. Please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you'll get notified when we upload more videos. Keep watching.